Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the world of cyber espionage where nations and corporations battle it out in the shadows for control of the global economy. Today we will delve into one of the most significant conflicts of our time, the chip war. Picture this, a world where everything is connected, from your phone to your car, from your fridge to your bank account. Now imagine if all that was taken away, if the very foundation of our digital lives was compromised. This is the reality we face as the chip war rages on. The chip war is a conflict between countries and companies over the production and distribution of computer chips, which are essential components in many electronic devices. At its core, the chip war is a battle for power and control in the global technology industry. The stakes of this conflict are high, as computer chips are critical to the functioning of everything from smartphones to military equipment. The outcome of the chip war could have far-reaching implications for the global economy and national security. It is therefore important to understand the nature of this conflict and its potential consequences. There are several major players in the chip war, each with their own unique interests and motivations. On the country level, we have the United States and China, both of whom are heavily invested in the semiconductor industry. In recent years, tensions between these two countries have escalated, leading to what many are calling a chip war. On the corporate level, we have companies like Intel and Qualcomm, who have long been dominant players in the chip market. However, new challengers like Huawei and Samsung are emerging, and they are poised to disrupt the traditional power dynamic. These companies are investing heavily in research and development, and they are rapidly gaining ground on their competitors. The stakes of the chip war are high, with both countries and companies vying for dominance in the global tech market. At the heart of the conflict is the development and production of semiconductors, which are essential components in everything from smartphones to cars to military equipment. With demand for these chips increasing rapidly, the winners of the chip war stand to gain a significant advantage in the global economy. However, the consequences of the chip war extend far beyond economic gain or loss. The conflict has the potential to disrupt global supply chains, leading to shortages and price increases for consumer goods. It could also lead to increased tension between nations, as countries seek to protect their own interests and secure access to vital technology. The stakes are high, and the outcome of the chip war could have far-reaching implications for the future of technology and international relations. As we look to the future of the chip war, there are a number of potential outcomes that could shape the global economy for years to come. One scenario is that the conflict escalates further, leading to increased tariffs, trade restrictions, and even military action. This could have significant consequences for countries and companies involved in the production and distribution of computer chips, as well as for consumers who rely on these devices in their daily lives. Another possible outcome is that the chip war reaches a stalemate, with neither side willing to back down but also unable to make significant progress. In this scenario, the conflict could drag on for years, causing uncertainty and instability in the global economy. Finally, there is the possibility that the chip war is resolved through negotiation or compromise, with all parties agreeing to a set of terms that allow for continued production and distribution of computer chips. In conclusion, we have explored the chip war and its major players, as well as the stakes and potential future outcomes of this conflict. It is clear that the global economy hangs in the balance, and the decisions made by these countries and companies will have far-reaching consequences. As we move forward, it is important to consider the ethics and implications of our technological advancements. We must strive for innovation while also prioritizing the well-being of humanity. Only then can we hope to build a better future for ourselves and generations to come. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe and we will catch you on the next one.